It's Jen here from A and Such and Such Ambi Scented Fragrance Supply. I'm making another whipped soap today, and I thought before I'd get started, I would talk about a few things that I had questions about. One of them was, do I feel safe to use my KitchenAid, um, say, to make mashed potatoes, since I have made soap in it? And the answer is yes. And the reason it is that is because you want to use a separate bowl and beater attachment. The KitchenAid machine itself is just fine, but I do recommend to use a separate bowl and beater attachment if you're going to make soap and bath and body care products. I keep it very clean. I wipe it down with alcohol after every use, no matter what I use it for. So um, I feel safe using it to make, say, a pie or something else, you know, but with a separate bowl. With that being said, I'm not going to bore you guys with the whole process again of making the whipped soap. Um, I just wanted to show you. I'll bring you guys back in intermittently and let you know what I'm doing. And so this soap is going to be Frosted Snowdrop. I'll be back in a minute. Okay guys, I've been whipping for about one full minute. And I'm going to scrape down my sides. Mmm. I just cast it. Huh? Uh. What? I don't have anything. No. You need your medicine though. We'll have to do you your medicine here in just a bit. Noah's had. I'm making soap. Yeah. This is whipped soap. It'll float for you and brother. Me? Yeah. My boat swim. Hmm? All right, guys, bring you back in a minute. Okay, guys, I whipped it for another minute. Now I am getting ready to add in my cream. I'll let you guys see me add that. Oh, let's go ahead and scrape our sides down before we do this. I recommend scraping your sides down several times. I mean, you really want to make sure you get everything. You can even, you know, get down in there and scrape that bottom. Daddy. Daddy, Mommy. Hmm? Daddy. Where is Daddy? Yeah. Probably taking a shower. I just not know. I just not know. Yes. Oh. Uh. All right. Now, I will start slowly adding my cream. Put this on about three. out of the fridge I actually put them in there to kind of help them get back not to solid you know but I want them back down to cold room temperature Mommy, what Austin can I go to the back board to stop moving? no because it's wet no, it ain't. it's not wet Come on, no, it's not. and um also in this solution here I'm just stirring it up because it's kind of gotten hard around the edges is I have added um, my goat milk, my kale and clay, and um, my oatmeal powder. So you can see it here. So I'm going to turn this on low, about two or three, and start slowly adding this.
this down. Scrape our edges. Now, when I add my lye, it will deflate it some. Oops, got that oil on my edge of my blender. I'm gonna wipe that off. All right, guys. Now I probably won't record adding the lye because I do it very slowly on about three or four settings. So I'll bring you guys back after I have the lye added. Okay, guys. I have added all of my lye. I'm going to scrape my sides down, and then we're going to whip it for a few minutes. And add our fragrance. Again, I'm not going to video me putting the fragrance in. I'm just bringing you guys along for my steps as I do them. And I tell you, something about coming down. Whip soap is not hard. Um, you can use a uh, normal hand mixer or hand blender sorry I probably yelled in your ear right there as I went by you but I've got my fragrance here and I'm going to turn this back on for a minute and then I'm going to slowly add in my fragrance and then I'll bring you guys back okay guys I have moved you back um I have just finished whipping my soap Here it is. I'm gonna take this out. Be careful banging it. You got some active, active life in there. Okay. are very very a lot and fluffy I see a little few little clumps here and there that may be my oatmeal so I'm not gonna worry with it I'm actually going to measure this off for my colors one is going to be a light blue well they're both kind of kind of be kind of a lightish blue And the other one is going to be a, another shade of blue. And then we'll have our main batter. And it is really like working with batter. Okay. So in my main batter... I'm going to add some of our fairy dust. Give this some sparkle. You guys see that okay? This one, it's got less in it. 
I think this should be my lighter blue. Huh. Now watch me be like totally wrong and backwards. Okay, just checking to make sure we've got it all mixed. What, Noah? It's a really nice color. What's the matter, Noah? Huh? Do you think I was in the bathroom? No, I am not touching. Yeah, I'm in the kitchen. You're funny. I'm funny? Yeah. No. Yes, you are. Yes, I am. Yes, you is, he said. Looks like I got two different shades of blue. Doesn't matter if they're not really starkly different. I don't care. I did this double. I did this double. I did this. Mommy, I did this on Christmas tree. Yeah. I did this out. Yeah. I took out the box. Mommy. What, babe? I took out this out on the box. Uh, where are you gonna take it? At the beach. To the beach. Yeah. Hmm. I don't sleep in. I don't sleep in. I don't sleep in my head. I don't do that at the beach. I did this at the beach. Yes or no? No. Oh. I take it to hell. I get the big house. If we are in the house. Sorry. Did I scare you? Yeah. Sorry. Okay. Get it on you, okay? Back up. 
Thank I'm you. I'm making soap. Yeah, I don't I'm want it to hurt you, buddy. Eating. Soap will burn you. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. Hi, chocolate. A hot chocolate down helmet. Yeah. Uh, um, oh. Mm -hmm. Ow! Stop it. Sorry. Okay. That's the bridge. Mommy making lots of noise? Yeah. You know I love you, right? I don't feel the flowy. The flowy. Hmm? The flowy, mommy. What is? Flowy. The flowy. The flowy. And then, I've had, and had, I've been in it, and I've been in it. And have. Are you done? Not yet. Is that, did this door go on that mannequin? Uh-huh. Oh, I'm making Thank you. Let me get my hanger tool. We're going to do a hanger in it. Oh, Mommy, is this a glass, a glass top and like the other one? Huh? Is that glass top and like the other one? Glass topping? Yes. Your mommy said I wouldn't. Hey, why? Do you remember? Yeah. Was well, that the same thing? Okay. Hey. Um, hey. Is that the same thing? Mm -mm. Yeah. Why is that glass? No. What is uh oh. Plastic. What? Plastic. Plastic. Back what? up, please. I'm afraid I'm gonna get it on you guys. Stop it. Sorry. Hold on, is this I'm a making noise. I'm making noise and touching. I know, I'm making noise. Hold on, is this a taller or a... That's a color. Oh, that's a very sparkly color. Yeah. Oh, that's a very sparkly color. Hold on, Mommy, are these Daddy's knives? Hey. Uh-uh, those are Mommy's. What, what, I don't use them one day? Yeah. I need it. We are going to use the sort. And, and those ones up there are daddy's. Yes. Does he use them? No. Well, Make a noise. Why does he never use them? Make a noise. Watch out. Make a noise. Yep, I'm going to make noise. I'm going to bang it the floor. <laughs> okay, hold on to me, Noah. Hold on to Noah, hold on. Um, as you can see here, I damaged that corner, but the soap is still in the mold, and it's still moldable to where I can get it out, and I can put it on, and I can smooth it. This is what I did last time, and it worked just fine. You can fix that damage just like so and let's get the other corner we'll fix it just want to and it kind of gives it a chance to stick back
because it's still pretty soft. Whip soap stays soft much longer than um, normal soap. And there's a piece off down here, just a little piece. You want your Mickey Mouse? Yeah. Is it a good? Is it not? Nah, um, they doing the dance? Yeah. Here, Noah. Hot diggity dog. Oh, nice. No. Hot diggity dog. I said that dog. Yeah, I hear you singing the hot diggity dog. Tell me, I'll loosen this one for you. Me? Here. You open that one left this way. You ain't that tight. Okay. It's loose, but he can't get it. Does he need help? Do you need help? No. No. He wants to try. Did you get it? Yeah. Woohoo! Good job. I got loosened. Oh yay! Look at that. Let me what? Let me what? Let me what? <laughs> wow. Mmm. <laughs> you guys are the sweetest. Hi guys. Hi guys. Okay, oh. Noah, quit. <laughs> what was doing? What was he doing? Putting his hand up in front of the camera. Bobby, hmm. who made you this? What? The, the cutter. Your daddy? I'm with the hand saw of Papa's. Mm-hmm. Why? Huh? Why? So I could cut my soaps? He could have used the... He could have made it inside with... A same saw. He did make it inside. Well, he took me outside with a same saw. No. Ah. Uh, look at how he did this wood. And you can see the glitter. We got it at Lowe's. In the weight. And that is quick. See if I can. There it is. Mommy. Mommy. What? That is quick. And I actually think what the little tiny places that I have. Mommy. What? I did it. I did it. a flex. Yeah. That are seepage. Those couple of little places. I really think that it is. I don't think it's the fragrance. Um, I think it's just little tiny pieces of shea butter that I did not get whipped good enough. I think that's what it is. So next time, I may um, melt the shea butter too and see if that gets rid of it. And if it does, then that's what that is. And if not, then it is the fragrance. We'll see. This is all a work in progress. Hot diggity dog. Hot diggity dog. Hey, hold on, Mommy. Did you buy this door or did it come with the house? It come with the house. And I'll show you guys the difference in the size of my bars uh, with the whip soap and a normal cold process soap. What? Okay. What? No, what? Almost to the end. The swirl turned out really pretty.
got one more cut. And then we'll do our samples. And I'll move this and I'll show you the difference in the size of the soaps. Let me clean up this really fast. Right. It's just rubbing alcohol. It's pretty much what I use to clean all of my items like this, my surfaces. 91% alcohol. Okay, let's move this out of the way. And get this cleaned up because it's quite a disaster. I guess our paper towels like crazy. It's a good thing I do coupons or I wouldn't be able to afford the paper towels. Just recently I went and got um, some bounty paper towels and paid 23 cents for them. So that really helped. Alright, so here is a bar and here is a bar of my normal soap. Let's see, right there you go. Here's a bar of my normal soap. You can see the difference in size, that this one is a bit taller. Just like that. So there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope to see you on my next one.